So it's Christmas in exactly a week. And if you're anything like me, you've left it till last minute to get your presents. Although you probably said last year, I'm gonna start my Christmas shopping early next year. And you still haven't. It's okay, I understand. I know you've tried, because I definitely tried. I went out a little while ago, tried to go Christmas shopping. Ended up coming home with 80% presents for China, 20% if that, presents for other people. As part of my China Does series, I'm gate crushing niches on YouTube. And this particular video this week is all about ideas. You will see these videos all over YouTube. However, I don't often see foolproof ideas. And what I mean by that is gifts that you can give people that you know they're gonna be grateful for. Now, this particular video isn't for your closest because I'd hope that you already know what to get them. But for the people that you're a bit unsure about, they may be new in your life, they may be not so close to you, but you need to buy them a present or it could be a secret Santa regardless of what it's for you have a week to go and you still need to buy their present although I'm basing this video around the festive period it does not mean you can't give these at any gift giving moment I know you're in a rush so let's get straight on to the foolproof gifts for the five different types of people that you probably have in your life the music lover now the best thing to get a music lover is a pair of headphones, a decent pair of headphones or a spare pair of headphones. Now I know they've probably got one, they've probably got a few, but you'll be so surprised that these people always seem to lose their headphones. Trust me, get them a pair of headphones that they can put in their bag that they have to grab at any given time that's not their usual pair, they'll thank you for it. And of course, if you know which ones they particularly want, those also are a very good gift. Another good thing for music lovers is a subscription. So for instance, Spotify, Apple Music, I'm a Spotify girl. Unlimited playlists, unlimited music, no adverts, where can you go wrong? The organizer. We all have that one person in our life that's extra organized. Trust me, they're gonna thank you for this. Although they may have already been a little bit organized for getting this already, if you know that they haven't, a diary or a notepad will always go down well. And I don't mean those cheap little diaries, I mean a nice looking one. I know you're on a budget, but push the boat out a little bit. I promise they'll thank you for this. Something that looks good, something that's gonna keep everything in one place for them, they will be really grateful for. Also, I have realized that things like the travel coffee mugs or pens, those sort of things, as non-exciting as it is to open, they're things that you don't like spending money on, but they're practical and they're something they're gonna actually use and they'll be grateful for. The foodie. You can go two ways with this one. If they are a sweet tooth person, grab a box, shove all their favourite goodies in one box and hand that to them. Trust me, they'll love you for it. Who is going to be unhappy with receiving a big box of their favourite treats? Why would you complain? I don't understand. Also another good shout for foodies is things like Groupon vouchers for new restaurants. Everyone likes to try a new restaurant out and you're paying for their meal. Why would they not love that? You can also get gift cards for food. Their favourite restaurant, they're always there. You know they're always there. Why do you pay for their meal? They're not exactly going to be disappointed, are they? You know they love that place. The homebody. Now being a homebody, I know that I particularly don't like people buying things for my home because unless you know my colour scheme and you know exactly what I like, it's a bit of a risk. But there are some things you can get them that they will be grateful for and they will love and it will fit into their home very easy without tarnishing their decor. Decor. <laughs> a good thing to always get someone is a blanket. I can't tell you how many blankets I've got in these years of my life. Trust me, a nice blanket that fits in with their colour scheme can always go down a treat. Also, things like candles, diffusers. Oh my god, a diffuser is probably one of the best things to buy someone that loves their home. It's just something you don't like to pay for, but every single home person loves and wants. They just don't like spending the money on it. They look pretty, they make the home smell good, and trust me, they'll love it. The fashionist. This one, I think out of all of these types of people is the most difficult because they are so particular on their style. Everyone has a different style and it's always a risk when you're buying a particular item for them. So the best thing to go with is a gift card to their favourite shop or a place that you know they always go, like for instance like Westfield, it's like a Westfield card. It's too risky, just don't do it, okay? I know you want to buy something that's clothing, but it's just... It's gonna sit in their wardrobe, they're not gonna wear it, don't do it, just buy them a gift card. They will be a lot more appreciative in their head, although they may not look so excited opening it. In their head, they'll be saying, thank God for this. 
at least I can actually buy what I want. So there you have it. Those are my quick fire round gifts that you can buy someone this week to make sure you have some presents in time for Christmas. Which one of these people are you? And do you have any other ideas that could potentially help anyone else out? If you do, make sure you comment in the comment section below because let's not be selfish and help some people out. <laughs> Give this video a thumbs up if you like what you've seen and I really hope this helps you get the presents you need in time for Christmas. Make sure you have a lovely Christmas and I will see you on my next video. Mwah. Thank you.